Wake up, Elliot. Uh, we there? No, still a ways to go. What? What's but from on? here we have to go on foot. Oh, now we're younger again. Yeah. We got baby face. So baby face. This guy's such a weirdo. Oh, I know. I'll send your husband on a raid so we can go on a date. There's well, a million things he could have asked him to do. Yeah, I I don't think he thought that it was gonna be that. Even then, even so. Yeah. You know? We've been in the car for two hours. You going to tell me why we're here? Because we need to get there. Come on, Jim. Be patient. I told you it's a surprise. I want you to find out for yourself. Or don't you like surprises? No. No. No, I don't. I'm trying to make San Esperanza safe and secure. Surprise implies a lack of security. <laughs> I got all the security I need in this gun. <laughs> America. You say so. America. Do as I say and you'll see. Take it from Jim Dockers. Because you're my friend, right? Don't let your guard down. You're a shitty friend. Not Jim. You. Oh, okay. I was like, what? Have you what? heard of the Voduna cult? You mean voodoo? Mm. Dolls and needles? Yes and no. It's different varieties of the same thing. The Vodun religion from East Africa. In Cuba, they call it Vodou. In Haiti, it's voodoo. Santa Esperanza had its own version. A little community that lived in these woods. No more than 200 people, I reckon. Had. Right. They say practically all of them died. A sort of civil war sparked up by betrayal. Betrayal between friends. Uh, okay. Show interest. Show interest. Really? What kind of betrayal? The Bodonas place particular importance on a person's name. Okay. They chose a name for themselves when they reached adulthood, and they only revealed it to their partners and their descendants. Is that so? So they're like Hanar. Legend says that while he was out hunting with his right-hand man, the chief of the Vodunas was attacked by... And what did everyone else call them? Hey, you? Come on, don't be a jerk. with this Elliot. We're really going out of the way for this surprise. Uh, this is like a weird surprise. It's probably going to be an actual birthday surprise, but... One, two, three. <laughs> they had different names for it. Neither did use. Nicknames similar to Indian names. I feel like this is like not going to end up being actually bad, but we're like, oh, we're a bad friend. He's going to kill us. <laughs> but not really. He's gonna be an actually a really, really, really good friend, and we're gonna feel even worse. Come on. It's your birthday, dude, or something? Anyway, while he was out hunting, yeah, like the chief of the tribe was attacked by a bear. Like, it's your birthday, here's a, a bear. Here's cabin. Yeah. Don't tell me you dragged me into a wood full of bears. I wasn't joking when I told you not to let your guard down. Shit. The chief's wounds look fatal, so he confided in his best friend, the best hunter in the tribe, and whispered his true name to him. The hunter left him in the woods, went back to the village, and told the news to the chieftain's wife and children. Well, that's tough. However badly wounded he was, he was his partner. You can't leave your partner in the woods, whatever state he's in. Let's hope neither of us has to make that kind of decision today. out here. I don't know. Oh. Sullivan River. Closing to the Donovan Dam, I think. I didn't think geography was your department. Sometimes I like to dabble in things that aren't officially my department. So I see. Oh. <laughs> uh-huh. 
I think he's suspicious of According us. According to Baduna law, from the moment the hunter whispered the dead husband's name to the chief's wife, he would take his place. In what sense? In the eyes of the tribe, he became him. He had to take on his role. Fulfill his sex Fulfill duties. his duties. Mm -hmm. Raise his children. And sleep with his wife. Ah. Uh, mm, I think we're in trouble, Stacy. I think so, too. Damn. Should be right here. What? The sign tells us which way we have to go. Must be hidden in the undergrowth. I'll search. Let me look for it. Okay, I'll cover you. Huh, this burned out a long time ago. Weeks, I guess. Looks like a... that's a very weird campfire. It looks like there's a sign up there. Look, there's lights all the way out here. Where are we? I don't know. This doesn't make sense. Oh! Animal attack. No doubt about it. He's very calm about this. Here's the sign. Looks like it was knocked over by a poacher's prey. Well spotted. Let's go on. You taking me to a church? I'm nervous. It's never a bad time to confess your sin. Okay. Maybe it's where they got married. Him and his wife. It would have been a long time to have been married. Yeah. Ah, you are blocking my target. Ah, sorry. Uh, that's kind of a big deal. What's wrong with you, Dockers? What's the problem? Old age. I can't compete with a young marksman like you. You're not going after it. Let's not push our luck. I don't want our story to end up like the Baduna chieftain and the hunter. Okay, let's go. So he has this young hot wife. Or something, right? Or something like that. They built the chapel after the massacre of the Baduna people. I thought it was nice. You still time. haven't told me how that me happened. Too. The hunter became the chief and moved in with his family. It wasn't the first time that kind of thing had happened. But one thing did happen for the first time. The wounds the bear had inflicted on the real chief were less serious than they seemed. A few days later, he came back and claimed what was his. But the hunter wasn't so sure. He was the chieftain now. Yes, but the hunter won his new identity by leaving the old chief to his fate. Oh, that's not what I was he trying to... He betrayed his friend. Whatever. No, I agree with you. That As makes sense. Oh, okay. Doom. I agree with that. I think I I thought I had picked the wrong one. I was trying to agree the that the chief is right. That yes, way. that's what you said. Oh, okay. The Badunas were split into supporters of the new chief and the old one. And, well, you know how it all ended. Elliot, I have a problem. I think Delphine is cheating on me with another man. Whoa. Some nights when I lie down next to her in bed, her hair smells of gunpowder. What? Someone who regularly handles guns is touching her. Oh boy. Do you have any idea who it could be? Uh. Confess. I'm sorry, Jim. I should have told you before. I don't even know how it started. 
I mean, he's clearly not gonna kill us. We're doing the right thing, either way. We're, we're manning it out! Jim, please, put the gun down. Yeah, Jim, put it down. You're late. You know why they built this chapel? We know. Typical Americans. They find that a bunch of crazies from some wacky religion have killed each other, and they build them a church, huh? <laughs> As if the dead give a damn about their Christian god. Jim, what's going on? I told you, it's a surprise. Who's going in? He is. Me? Trust me. Oh. Uh -huh. uh. <laughs> okay. Oh, is this the place where the kids are being held? I I don't... Maybe? But why would he surprise us with that? That seems... Surprise! Yeah. Yeah, you believe in godness? Ugh. In my own way, I guess. Yeah? Although I doubt splashing your face with water has much to do with it. I mean, we're alone with two guys with guns. I don't know what the right answer is. Yeah. What do you mean you don't believe in God? Uh, I don't know. I know, I feel like someone who's being vague is the best choice. The best choice. Someone had some fun at these critters' expense. Oh, look at that skeleton chilling out at the bottom. Oh, wow. Look at this. This is a very interesting setup right here. Yeah, that's a, that's a very intricate statue to be lost in the woods to. Yeah. Mary Magdalene, the prostitute who repented and washed the feet of Christ. Oh, this is a sexy kind of church. I love how the how the skeleton's just chilling. Mm -hmm. Sup? No, he's he's not even he's reclining. He looks like Burt Reynolds in that Cosmopolitan centerfold. <laughs> you know where he's like laid out, he's got hey. his chest hair everywhere. Hey babes. Hey. Uh oh, there's a guy. Ooh, what is this? I have a gun pointing at your head. I can kill you right now. But you haven't. So you're either a big mouth or a coward. Ooh. I won't shoot. I'm here to help you. Yeah? Look under your knees. Something weird. What is this? To you, just a bunch of scribbles. But to someone who knows what he's looking at, it could be prison bars for Capone. What, he hates reading so much he sees a book as a prison sentence? Very funny, yes. Your financial specialist Garrison, he'll know what to do. Why are you doing this? What do you care? I'm serving you Capone's head on a golden plate. Don't ask questions. Just beat it, Ness. The sooner you set Garrison to work, the sooner all this will be over. That's a really nice thing. It's really, really pretty. Yeah. Gotta hate cops. Hey! Carmine? Please, no. Why? He, he threatened my kids. Capone? No. You're his right hand man, his chief executioner. He's lost his mind. He suspects everyone and everything. He has to be stopped. Don't kill me, for my kid's sake. You remember Don Prescott? 33 years on the force, my first partner. You left his face in such a mess, they had to make him a clay mask so his family could look at him at the funeral. 
Capone wanted him dead. What about Amber Fisher, 15 years old? You held her prisoner for three days. She committed suicide only hours before we came to rescue her. I don't need to remind you what you did to her, do I? I was following orders. No. Capone orders you to kill. You improvise. You enjoy it. You can't do this. Elliot, don't do it. Kill an unarmed man and it'll haunt you your whole life. I deserve a trial. We're cops, not killers. Jesus, weren't you... Control your anger. Weren't you the most honest man in Santa Esperanza? Not about police brutality. No, I feel Go like... Go back to Capone. Don't let him suspect a thing. And when I bring him to justice, you'll testify against him. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Ness. Thank you. Well done. I made that mistake once. Only once. And it still torments me. Let's go. It's like if the, if the systems are implemented, you know, don't be a weirdo. Yeah. The one time... Congratulations, Carmine. Great performance. My kids, don't worry. I'm not going to touch them. Thank you. Thank you. I always keep my word. If Capone finds out what you made him do, he'll kill me. Uh, that won't happen. You have my word. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well, I think Capone is going to need a new right hand man. If you were a gangster, I feel like... I, I know it's not practical. You'd be more aware. Well, no, I, I feel like it's not practical to say, like, why would you have kids or a family? But why would you have kids or a family? Yep, pretty much, yeah. You know? Why? Did Carmina get in touch with you? How did you do it? It doesn't matter. Stroke of luck. Now, all we need to do is be careful. See what Garrison can find. Jim, about Delphine... Shut it. First we finish Capone, then we talk. Okay. He's like, I don't have time to deal with you. What? Wow, oh, don't tell me your friends let you down again. Lucky you got me. Um, I'm losing my mind. Friends, we let our friends down. That's <laughs> the opposite. What? No, but we, nobody let us down. Wow, weird shit's going on, huh? So, whoa. What, what, what's happening? Suddenly, it's first person mode. Hey, look, it's the face of Lemiz. Lemiz? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Looks like her. I'm not gonna say the whole, uh... Les Miserables? Yeah, no, Les Miserables of this. It's only logical that Dawkins should abandon you. He just told oh, me to screw his there? wife. Honest and moronic. But what about the others? What will they think of you? Think of me for what? I mean, this is like 20 years ago. so creepy. They all had to sit there for like two minutes in an uncomfortable, posi uncomfortable position. And they also took pictures of dead people. Yeah, I know that. And they, or, or the photos where they would like put a blanket over the uh, mother so she could hold the baby. <laughs> Whoa. How come you 
lose touch with everyone, Ness. Or maybe it's just that anyone who gets close to you winds up dead. You should try to save her. Right. <laughs> Oh, is that our friend? The female friend? What's wrong with Alice? It's funny. You don't mind giving half your earnings to some two-bit thief who walks into your restaurant, but when your friends are in danger. No, please no. Oh my god, is Alice... Alice was our buddy, right? Well, this is... I don't... This is a, like a dream, so I... Alice? Alice? Oh, what is that? <laughs> <laughs> this game? Okay, I'm glad that they took the time to make this a good episode. The wire was tapped. They broke into my house. Why did you get me mixed up in this? Oh, shit. Alice! Oh, no. Wait, when did this happen? This didn't happen, right? I... The, I didn't know that this had happened, but I, I honestly... I feel like we forget we call, things. Yeah, but it's been six months. Yeah. No, I just remember... No, she's not dead. I don't remember her dying. Maybe I was too hard on you. Some friends you do help. Maybe he, this is what he's like afraid of. old Capone. You should have shot him 20 years ago. But instead of that, you're a lateness. You're a failure. <laughs> you have up with him on the condition he donates a tiny fraction of the money he's stolen over the years. My father asked you to take care of me. Is this how you respect a dead man's wishes? Oh, God. Very good. You've picked your friends. Elliot, please. Say goodbye to the others. Alice, I... No! Alice! This is a nightmare. It has to be. Okay. Huh. Poor guys, huh? You're the one that should be in the body bag, not them. By the way, where were you? Elliot Ness. Dr. Dawkins to the F7. Daphine, no. Not you. Okay, so this didn't I'm happen. Followed, Elliot. From the diner. What are you mixed up in? Okay, so this is just insecurity. Ah, I see. You were suggesting an escape plan to your secret sweetheart. Oh. This reminds me of, uh... That wheelchair reminds me of Red Dragon, where, uh... Delphine, no! Not you! Don't worry, Delphine, I'm coming! Uh... You remember that part in Red Dragon where he ties him to a chair and sets him on fire? No! Oh. Sounds like I missed out on a lot! <laughs> And that's another movie I erased from my mind. <laughs> yeah, Scarface, Requiem for a Dream. Oh god, not erased. that movie. I don't even think about it. Erased. Oh god. Yeah. Requiem for a Dream, no. Now imagine being me and watching that. No, nope, 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 nope. Yeah. Well, oh, this is... You'll never learn, Elliot. You'll go on putting all the people you love in danger, won't you? Until you're completely alone. Wow, this is this game. This episode is. Whoa. You know, and normally I hate dream sequences in games, but apparently they're usually just shittily done because I don't mind this. You're like, yeah, cool. Oh God, Delphine, no. no. 
Why didn't you just get married to someone else and have your own kids, you weirdo? <laughs> What are you going to do when you're done crying? Now you don't even have the option of getting drunk. We're a failure. He didn't even have the cojones to finish off his goon in the church. I doubt you'll be able to deal with the real problem. We're a failure. The only thing you ever did right was put me away. How'd you do it, huh? How? Tell me. That's the spirit, Elliot. I'm sure this guy you believe in, in your own way, approves of strength, right? Die. That's right. Yes, kill me. Die! You know which part of yourself you're killing, don't you? Die! 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 What? Whoa. Did the game crash? Die! Cool it, Mr. Ness. Alphonse is taking care of that. <laughs> that was a lot of crazy yeah. shit. <laughs> yeah. You knocked me out. You betrayed me. Betrayed you? Calm down. <laughs> Since when will we part? <laughs> I know. Oh, is... so ah! I feel like punching's not enough. What's going on up there? You know what I mean? Like he does a bunch that, of shit and you're like, oh, let's punch him. Like, okay, what? Those no, you just want to drag it out. To be the pillars of Titus Andronicus's palace. Well, you, I He's don't know, like kill cut his fingers off or something. Yeah, most likely. It says here, this is the Shakespearean tragedy that has the most deaths in it. Talk, you bastard! I don't. Uh, I'd say Capone is Titus. And Ivankov is Aaron, who ordered the kidnapping, rape, and mutilation of Titus's daughter, Lavinia. What do you think? You son of a bitch! Talk! Ah! Ah! You are wrong! Ah! We can't let him kill him before he confesses. I'm sorry, buddy, but what we can't do is to interfere in Alphonse's plans. Remember what he did to Burke? In five minutes' time, Ivankov will be dead, and your beloved Alphonse will never find his granddaughter. <laughs> Fine! Oh, uh, God! I'm reading, though! <laughs> <laughs> I like that he reads Shakespeare, and he's just like... <sighs> you have a Come point, on. but... You'll need help. God! I'm at the good part! Uh, let me explain. <laughs> I don't know, I feel like they should be like, uh oh you know. Oh, it's that weird breathing guy. Yeah. Take a rest. Al, I didn't do a thing. This is all a mistake, I swear. Are you sure? Because what I found in your submarine makes me think otherwise. What the fuck did you find? You keep a register full of names. The names of people you sold to the Ku Klux Klan, to pimps like Abdulkader, or to slave traders. All right, yes. I make people disappear. Uh, you don't know how hard it was to survive after you went away. Santa Esperanza went crazy. The cops, the judges, the other families. They all wanted to destroy your empire. I had to make a living. What about the children? What children? I never kidnapped a child. Never! Um... In your submarine, there's a container with mattresses barely a yard and a half long, and drawings of kids gunning down your men. Have you seen them? Yes! For Christ's sake, yes! I traffic in children, too. Fuck! I'll kill you. But I never kidnapped your granddaughter, Al. Your family is my family. I've also seen Baccarini's accounts. You paid him $2,500 for some forged papers. 
in the name of Guido Colombo. Son of a bitch, let me go! Steady, Alphonse. It's a lie! It's a lie! He's a fucking cop! How can you believe him? time you're right Nikolai I'm a fucking cop but despite my reputation I'm not a good cop uh, and what the fuck are you going to do with me I don't know just cut his balls off or something I put together a file on you years ago when you were working for Capone you left a family behind in Russia used to send them money are your parents still alive I'm sure your brother is. And his three kids. Or has he had more? You're bluffing! Wanna take a trip to Russia, sugar kid? I never heard a kid scream in Russian, my friend. I've never seen her. She told me to find nine kids for her not long after Al went into the slammer. Not just any nine kids. They were all the sons of criminals. Corrupt cops. Murderers. Rapists. A woman? She set up a meet in the caves at Rockford, in the darkness. I never saw her face. A week ago, she had me meet her again. The same place, the same assignment, just like 20 years ago. But with new kids, including Sofia Capone. What else? That's it. There has to be more. Maybe there's someone else who does business with her. Back in the day, I had a mole working undercover with the Gravedigger's men. You mean Elaine Ganella? We were all spying on each other. We had to slice up the cake that Al had left behind. A few days after the assignment, Ganella took care of the bodies of eight kids. Oh dear God, not again. Did Ganella tell you why? Elias? This son of a bitch was behind the case that ended my career 20 years ago. <laughs> the missing children were murdered. Why? Tell me why, you son of a bitch. Did she tell you? No. Why should she? I don't usually fraternize with the competition. That is all. I am dead. And then he dies. You huh? have no idea. Nope, don't do that. Mm. You said that. Screw everything I said. Don't do it. I don't it. know what you think. Yeah, there you go, pussy. You don't have the guts to do shit. Well, you can still suffer now. I like that's my me. that is my you reasoning. I know. Someone like you. Oh dear. Do something. No, please, no. Good Whoa. job. Good for him. His bodyguard. No, he just wants to go. He's happy. I don't know. No, he killed his master because his master's a douche. I don't know if yeah. that's the case, though. Or maybe he wanted him to stay silent and he works for the other guy? He, he might just, yeah, he might oh just my work God. for somebody else. What if he's the one who won the gauntlet of the last section of kids or something? Mm -hmm. Improvised weapon! Oh wow. Oh, do you think this is the guy who like ripped the other guy's face off in the last game? 
something, you know? Yeah. Oh. Still worried about what I'm gonna see under that mask. Maybe we won't look. He's got claws. Well, he's, we've got to look. I need to know, but I'm worried about it. Where do you buy those things? He wasn't his bodyguard. He was his jailer. Oh, yeah. okay. How do I go up there? Nope. Can't. I guess we'll just walk out like a cool guy. See you later. Maybe talk to the... Peeps. Nope. Nope. Can't talk to the peeps. Nope. Alright, then I guess we're gonna get the fuck out of here. Gonna walk out like a cool guy. Let's go. If that thing found us, there'll be more on the way. Alright. I'll go by the suite to pick up my things. Yeah, so I think that he was basically charged with keeping track of Ivankov. Make sure he doesn't say anything? Yeah. Ah, okay. What's going on? Why is this so terrible? What's... Huh? Change of plan. I don't want my things anymore. Where is Mr. Capone? Where is he? There's no one by that name here, sir. Oh, it's that freaky floor that's glass. Like, yeah. This. I would freak out all the time. We have to help them. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. What? That's suicidal. There's too many of them. And only Ness is carrying a gun. I'ma do it, bro. I'ma do it! Don't tell me what to do. Don't tell me what I can't do! Don't tell me what I can't do! It's the best way to get me to do something! Yeah, I'm a badass. Oh, you better. Oh, I thought I was shooting his hand so they would be knocked out of his, out of his uh, hand. You know, like, oh, I'm, I'm a badass. We did it. I think there might be other guy. Uh, yeah, is that we're it? fine. You okay? <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Dice. Oh, ho, ho! Hey. He doesn't expect the lady to kiss him. Nice. Nice. Let's go. He's like, he's like, okay, stranger, you be on your way. And we're like, oh, wow! wow! <laughs> <laughs> That's sexier than anything. I know. <laughs> How many bullets can you take, dude? It's like way too many. And one for you. Everyone, just please stand. Just stay right where move. you are. Don't move. Don't use cover. Just stand right there. Let me just line Mario this get you up. Four or five bullets from now. God, that guy was just absorbing them. <laughs> I know. Like right around the neck area. <laughs> When he starts thinking, he'll scare you even more. So I'd be kind of freaking out right now seeing as we're on a glass floor in a blimp that's on fire. Um, I'm sure it's fine. Oh. <laughs> he took a bullet to the dick. Look at you him, look at him, watch this. <laughs> <laughs> the first bullet he took it, he was just kind of like, ugh. Ugh, power him, like, through it. He clench his balls and like pop the bullet back out. <laughs> He caught it with his balls. He caught it with his balls, and then just the balls are like, Is that all you got? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, the mental image of that, like talking balls. What the? Spinning, spinning out the bullet like it's an old cigar. Keep the change, you filthy like, animal. Look at these guys with their huge stances, and it's like, bam, don't give a shit. Bam, 
Bam! They don't care! <laughs> These are some balls of steel! What now? You know this place better than me. Any other exits? There's another cable car for emergencies. Which way? That way. Alright, looks like we gotta we fight our okay? way through. Yeah. For the time being. Shooting them in the dick because they're like, check out my dick! Check out my dick! <laughs> and then their legs just like snap together. <laughs> uh oh. Use your punching powers or something. Nope. Whoa. No way. Did you hear him? You were talking shit, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see what he's doing. That was not a solid punch, but whatever. It's fine. I really like this game. I'm willing to overlook a couple of mechanical You see how they like, choose? This game is like campy and stupid and we love it. Yeah. It's me, Ness. Life's full of little twists and turns. Huh? What? Oh, I thought he was going to betray us. I was like, dude, come on. I just did so much for you, you dick. You dick? No, because he wants our help to find his granddaughter. I don't think he would do that. Ah! Ah! Oh, we got it then. Prepare to die, Capone! My father died because of you! Well, Capone, this is what oh, happened. No. Amazing what sticks in people's mind. <laughs> I mean, we're not justified in these killings at all, but okay. You know, Whatever. the only justification I have is that they're probably all gangsters who have probably all murdered a bunch of people. Ah, okay. It's not all just... Because what I'm thinking is like, it's a bunch of like nice people who gang together and they're like, no, we need our revenge! No. We don't really know what we're doing! Oh god, no way. I mean, they are wearing gangster hats, so... Yeah! <laughs> Clearly! Wait, check out this dude. Oh. Also, they appear to be semi-organized. <laughs> oh, look at this guy! Whoa! That guy came dressed to party. I don't know what, what's going on. Oh, he's, like, he's like, guys, this is my killing Al Capone outfit. Duh! Save this. It looks like he showed up for a party, and then this started happening. He's like, ah, whatever, dude. Whatever. I'm in. I'm down. Amazing how these people just sit there and like they'll just absorb the bullets. Like if they're not even being hit. Bullet absorption. Oh yeah? Oh yeah? They just take them straight to the dick and they don't even care. Oh. Hey, it's party guy! Try something. Oh, fuck! Oh, no! Let 
Let me try something. didn't have to shoot the tank, I just shot him in the shoulder and he was like, oh, I'm overreacting and I exploded. I spontaneously combusted! We're not gonna get out of here. So what's the secret ingredient? We'll get out of here. We have to keep moving. Uh, shame. Uh, what? Who we side with, I guess? What? I don't know. Oh, who we want to play as. Oh, cool. Uh, yeah, I want to have a shotgun. Good job! <laughs> Man, party guys, like, can take bullets. They're like, nope, don't give a shit. Which way? That way. The service entrance. Service. Let's I can't go. even do it. <laughs> the service entrance. You said it like all like, I don't know. Ser uh, I can't. I can't even do it. Okay. Just. No, I'm gonna keep trying. Service! Service! Ladybugs, if they wanted to get high earlier. <laughs> I, I was like, hey, ladybugs, you want to go get high? They're like, yes, Stacy, I love it when you get over. <laughs> I, I bought ladybugs to eat. Uh, to eat? eat to Mar eat. Mar eats ladybugs. No, to have them eat the pests in my aquaponics system. Because I have to use organic means, otherwise, it hurts the fish. Yeah. Stacy saw them, she's like, hey ladybugs, you hey, wanna ladybugs. get high? And then she blew her vape on them. I was like, okay. <laughs> yeah, not not weed. <laughs> no, oh, you guys are clear. She smoked weed in her vape. No. <laughs> it's true, she does all the she does drugs. <laughs> so they're gonna touch the water? Oh no. Okay. I thought that would do something cool. We got hundreds of them on our team. Why there's some... We have to get to the cable car, start it, and wait for the reach of that. Oh. Come on. So I guess we gotta... Oh, you're still alive. Wow. Soaking him up. Nice. That was completely by accident. I know. <laughs> nice accident. Nice accident. <laughs> it's kind of like when you get like a 360 no scope on accident and you're like, wow, I am so good at games. Whoa, that was on purpose. And you're like, check this out, everybody watching. I'm good at video games. Yeah. On purpose. On purpose. You remember the November 9th massacre? I arranged a meet with Leo Maldonado in the garage on 72nd and May. I was alone, but the son of a bitch turns up with 30 men. Fortunately, I brought along one of these beauties. 
You should have seen the faces on those jokes. Jokes. On those jokes. Whoa. Oh, okay. Well, I think I get never ending uh, tennis balls from what this looks like. I feel like I'm shooting just tennis balls. That guy came out of nowhere. He just popped up. You douche. No, he's not gonna leave it. He is! He's gonna start it so that it starts going and then Elliot will run. No. Run. See? He's a douchebag. Whoa, oh, shit. shit! What? Oh, thank God. Thank you. No, stop shooting. Because why? I don't, I don't know. know. <laughs> He just did something cool. Stop shooting. Fuck you! Fuck you! Uh. Are you okay? Too much excitement? Not bad for a couple of has huh? Oh, how many did we kill? Oh no, my never ending ammo is More done. Than I've seen in 13 years. No, he's got the billet. Well, we only had 300 bullets, now we only have one. No, he was thinking- I'm I know, it was a joke because- But uh, for people who don't remember... He, he had the about dream about killing the guy, I know. It's just that he was like, I have millions of bullets, but now I have one. No, he had- that's his bullet. It's a joke! I know, but for- you didn't let me finish telling people why! Okay, For those who don't remember- <gasps> <gasps> oh! No! Why, dude? What? Friendship! Pleasure to have you as a partner, sugar kid. <laughs> oh, no! And that was Capone's boyfriend, too. Aww. Oh! Ew! This is that thing, I think, that, like, ripped that guy's hands off and stuff, too, I think. What? It's one bullet. You gotta... Uh, I wonder if it'll survive that. I don't know. Maybe that's the creature from the last cycle, or maybe not, because they wouldn't leave that to be expendable, right? I'm not sure. Maybe they got other creatures they can... But I would imagine Al is pretty upset right now. Maybe it's one of the failed kids from the last cycle, and they turned them into monsters. Al, you okay? Oh god. Oh god, Ray. Oh god! Oh. Uh, no use crying. We have to focus on finding your granddaughter. None of those options seemed very nice. I, I said you pragmatic. saved my ass several times. Literally. And I don't need to tell you what a big shot mafioso keeps his ass for when he goes into jail. He saved me. Looks like it's clear. 
Let's go. Is this dump safe? It'll have to do. Besides, they're looking for you. They may not have recognized me. You're a big boy now. Screw you, miss. I'm in no mood for jokes. Damn it. Uh-oh. Spooky music's happening. Spooky, spooky. Oh, no. What's oh. in the box? What is what this? Is, oh. What's in the box? What's in the box? No! Oh, shit. What is in the box? Yeah. What the fuck? Holy Christ. Okay, at least it wasn't something we cared about. <gasps> Eyeballs! But who? I don't know. Who's eyeballs? Who's eyeballs, man? Who's eyeballs? <laughs> what? I really like Elliot's voice actor. His, me, me, me. his voice. Me, me, me. I don't know why, I really like it. <laughs> because it's like a... I don't, I don't... That's not always like a thing for me, though. I just specifically like his character. Oh, look at this, this is so cool! like a big statue you know I think you forgot how cool it was from last time me it, that like, I forgot bo both of us yeah we're like oh yeah this game is actually awesome I forgot well I mean it's like I remembered it as being awesome but it's like you forget all of the specifics of why it is so awesome yeah you know? they, they, they go the extra mile I yeah think. they got these like cool statues and shit I'm really upset. That Milton died? Ray? Yeah. I thought he was going to be our buddy through and through. I know. Like, oh, he's our buddy, like, forever. Like, this is our buddy. Then we have General Grievous at the top for some reason. Look at how cool that looks, though. That's like, you know? Yeah. Uh, for some reason. It's... No, yeah, it's... <laughs> Yes, yeah, Stacy. Fire on top of water with like that's shit. Just stuff. A that's just I feel like that's, that's just cool. A, you can't a, go wrong. It's a fire sculpture <laughs> for your credits. That's great. <laughs> you can't go wrong. <laughs> They're like, what should we do for our credits? Uh, um, a fire sculpture with a skull being on top of it. Yeah. Duh, idiot. Of course. Oh yeah, the kids. Is that alive? <gasps> oh. She got a puppy. It's not fair. It's your fault I like this. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Yeah, now you're sorry. I mean... Whatever. Who cares anyway? I don't have a hand. They don't feed me. And they gave you a puppy. It's not fair. Well, I mean, you were kind of terrible, but you're also a child. So I, I haven't know. eaten anything either since I don't know when. A long time. <gasps> they want to see the puppy. Neither is Groucho. Poor little thing is so hungry. He's just a puppy. And they cut off my hand. I don't feel good. I don't want to die. Optimism. We'll get out. You wait and see. I hope so. I miss my mom and dad, and my brother, and my toys. OK, 
Okay, why would you bring up toy? Okay, whatever. And Will you let me friends. play with Groucho? No. He needs to rest. He's very He's gonna kill that puppy. No way. <gasps> to bring a present for your little doggy. His name is Groucho. Give it to her. The milk will do him good. He has to grow. He needs to get big and strong. What do we say? Thank you. No. Thank you, honey, for being such a good girl. Let's go. We can just share the milk. Give it to me, please. I need it more. It's just a dog. Can we just share it? Bruno. Yeah. I'm sorry, Groucho. You'll leave a little for him, won't you? Sure. You're a liar. If you don't leave any for the dog, I'll smack you in the face. Groucho, look! I have your milk! Oh no, he's gonna- You want some? <gasps> Come over here! No! Oh! Easy. Easy, we don't want you to choke. Groucho, if you cry, I'll have to punish you. Oh, You're no. hurting him! You asked for this. <gasps> what? <laughs> oh, the milk isn't enough. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with this game? It's not funny. I don't think it's funny. Oh god. I don't think that is funny. Uh oh. AJ, come here. AJ, come here. Don't go to Stacy. She's crazy. Come here, AJ. How can you? I mean, it's not real. How can you not think it's funny? Come here, AJ. <laughs> we can't trust her anymore. <laughs> don't hang out with Stacy anymore. Don't. don't You're me. talking to the don't. person who laughed after can your pet. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> AJ, don't hang out with Stacy anymore. <laughs> She's, she's a wolf. She's a weirdo. I swear to God, if we were starving, she would probably kill you for food. That is not true. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. What have you done to prove otherwise? I would not. Uh, no. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. I know. <laughs> that was fucked up. <laughs> that was so fucked up, AJ. She's so little. I also feel like, in the vein of what we've been playing and seen today. That's just no. like the icing. There's no excuse for laughing right in front of AJ. He saw what you did. The icing on the fucked up AJ, cake. AJ, AJ, you saw what you did. You did that right in front of AJ. Yeah. He was watching. Look at him. Look at you. He's completely. You completely changed in his eyes. He's looking at you like, no way, dude. No way. <laughs> I don't think so. No, he's like. That's fucked up, Stacy. Nah, We're not friends time. anymore. Dogs yawn when they're nervous. Really? Look at it. Yeah. You AJ, know baby, that. yawn. <sighs> no, you can't touch my dog. You'll trick him. I don't want you to give him any treats. <laughs> if we're ever locked away and you're like, oh, can I play with AJ for a while? No. I can't believe that, though. We chose the worst option. Yeah. I knew that kid was bad news, but I was like, nah. Should have given it to Groucho. The only thing I've learned is that if I have food, give it to my own dog before I give it to my friends. Yes. <laughs> AJ's in my lap now, safe from Stacy. AJ, it's okay. 
<laughs> I won't let Stacy eat you. Ah, oh. oh. it's like I, it keeps going to the most fucked up level. I'm like, oh no, what if he like kills the you dog? Know, it's so, it's so weird because like I feel like sometimes when things go too much in one direction, it's like they jump the fucked up shark. Yeah, jumping the fucked up shark. Yeah. But it's it's like a slow burn. They like go up high and then they come back down and then they go up high again. And then they slowly go back up again. Yeah. Yeah, it's really hard to look at because this is happening to kids and puppies. You know what it is? It's so with any like horror movie or like action movie, it's about, it's about like pacing and making it. You can't have it be like up at 10 for the whole movie. Yeah. Know? Like Game of Thrones to... is like 10 10 10. You're like, "Calm down." And well, in the in the show it's like that, but in the books it's like you have it's, like five pages where they talk about the food. Yeah, you know. In the in the books it's like really well paced. Like Daenerys will talk about how she fucked seventeen people, and she was like, it was a real fuck fest. And yeah. Then they'll like cut off all the penises in the city. No par puppies were harmed or eaten during the development of this episode. Hmm. Hmm. But in any case, when you have games that kind of go like up and down like that, then it's more six more. It does it more successfully because, you know. Yeah, because you you can hit the fucked up moments without people getting tired of it. Yeah, because at some point you just uh, you run out of care. Yeah. yeah. Twenty years ago. Elliot, whose side are you on? Looks like someone's tying up loose ends for me. Tell me straight, you killed him, didn't you? Uh, he was eaten alive. What? Put those instincts to witness. Just when I thought we were getting closer to Sophia. He kills them at the end. He seems determined to carry out this ritual on individuals with connections to the underworld. You said you'd find her, Ness. That you'd save her. That you'd bring her back to me. Oh yeah, the choices. <laughs> you told know, twelve percent of people said they'd run away. <laughs> Maybe because that doesn't make any sense. I don't know. I thought he was gonna stand up and run out of the like fine, be that way. And like run. I thought it would have been funny. Like run out of the restaurant. I don't want to be with you either. Ah! You tried to confess to doctors telling him about your affair with Delphine. Who are the 17% of people that blame it on somebody else? I don't know who it could have been. It's like, he clearly knows it's you, dude. Yeah. Okay. You ring calm and really blah, blah, blah. Just decide to save the babe. Save the babe. Oh, like, we're supposed to remember who Susan is. Well, they gave her a name. I think that's good. You know? As opposed to just... Chose to say a heartfelt goodbye. Oh. Oh, I should have said, what's the secret ingredient? Well, there was no wrong answer, really. Yeah. No, what? No, it couldn't have. It wasn't that one. The secret ingredient was the one at the bottom. So there was another one, and I don't remember what it was. Be give a heartfelt goodbye. Yeah, but I don't remember what the, like the the two word clue was that was supposed to tell us. You remember? Yeah, I don't know. You know, okay. it's like they give you like a a thing, a word or two, and they it's somehow you're supposed to determine. No, it, there's one thing that they showed you six months ago, and then, uh, that's it. That's and, what you know. And most of the time, I feel like, for this game, you get, we guess it pretty right. You know? Some... I think the level design was pretty good, because we were able to figure things out pretty quickly. Yeah. And it was pretty obtuse, so. Alright. Um, what'd you guys think? Too yeah. fucked up? So fucked up, but I loved it. I loved it. Alright. Bye, guys. Bye. Ooh, oh, AJ. Oh, dear.